Eden's Garden Essential Oils presents Top 10 Essential Oil Mistakes Number 1. Applying Essential Oils Neat When used undiluted, essential oils can be highly irritating to the skin. For this reason, it's always recommended that you dilute essential oils using a carrier oil such as jojoba, olive, or coconut oil. Number 2. Ingesting Essential Oils in almost all cases, you can obtain the benefits of essential oils by using them topically or inhaling them. In rare cases, essential oils are beneficial when ingested, but this should only be done under the consultation of a certified aromatherapist to avoid adverse reactions. Number 3. Adding essential oils to water. Oil and water don't mix. This means that if you're using essential oil in water and then applying it to your skin, or drinking the water that contains the essential oil, you're using the oil undiluted which can lead to irritation of the skin or the membrane lining your internal organs. Number 4. Repeatedly using the same oil. Just as your body can build up a tolerance to substances and medications, it can also build up a tolerance to essential oils if they're used repeatedly. Switch it up once in a while by using different oils. Number 5. Continuing to use an essential oil after having a reaction. Having an allergy-like reaction to an essential oil could mean that you've developed a sensitivity to that oil, you are allergic to that oil, or the oil has expired. It is therefore not recommended that you continue using the oil. Number 6. Disregarding safety advisories of essential oils. Always check an essential oil's safety guidelines before using them. Safety information for Eden's Gardens oils can be found on each individual oil's product page. Number 7. Using essential oils on infants. Almost all essential oils should not be used on or around babies. There are very few exceptions, and it's always best to or on the side of caution when it comes to young children. Number 8. Using essential oils without skin patch testing. When using a new essential oil topically, it's always recommended that you perform a skin patch test. This means applying a diluted drop of the oil to an area of skin, such as the inner elbow, and covering it with a band-aid. After 12 plus hours, remove the band-aid and check for signs of a reaction such as redness or irritation. Discontinue use if a reaction occurs. Number 9. Diffusing for upwards of 1 hour. Studies have shown that essential oils are most effective when diffused for 30 to 60 minute intervals in a moderate sized room. Diffusing longer can lead to adverse reactions such as headaches and nausea. Number 10. Disregarding expiration dates. Each oil has an expiration date. With Eden's Garden Oils, the shelf life begins when you open your bottle. It's important to keep note of this date and to discontinue topical use once the oil expires. Discover more essential oil tips at edensgarden.com.